Hello, my name is Eiri and today we will have a look at Greek mythology. Now, even though Greek mythology is one of my absolute joys, I feel like there are so many amazing channels out there, I usually don't have anything new to bring to the table, and well, I still don't, <laughs> but I found something that I really wanted to talk about, and also, a video like this is just a great excuse for me to draw Apollo a lot, so it's a win-win. <laughs> But yeah, as I said, today's video is gonna be about Apollo and Cyrene. Now, I picked this myth mainly because of one thing. One of my favorite statues is the Apollo of Cyrene housed in the British Museum. It's absolutely gorgeous and I love it. And as one does, I wanted to look a bit into the background and mythology of the place where it was found. So here is how the story goes. There was once a girl named Cyrene, the daughter of the King Hypsius, and a naiad or a nymph. There was a version of the myth where she is a nymph herself and not a mortal, but I will be talking about the mortal one, even though it doesn't change much. Now, Cyrene was cool. <laughs> she wasn't your everyday princess, she was a hunter. She guarded the cattle of the king, her father, and one day a lion was threatening the sheep, so instead of choosing a sword or a spear, she wrestled the lion into submission. How cool is that? <laughs> And Apollo, seeing her wrestle the heck out of the beast, was smitten. I mean, who wouldn't be after seeing that? But anyway, he wanted to make her his bride, as myths kind of go with Apollo, and he did so. In some version, he consulted Chiron first, who gives him his approval. So he abducted Cyrene and took her to North Africa. There he established a new city, Cyrene. I know, how original. <laughs> and he made her its queen. Later, she bore him children, from which the most important is Aristeus, the god of beekeeping and also, in some accounts, the guy kind of responsible for Eurydice's death. <laughs> and the next was Idmon, in some accounts, the seer on the ship Argo. And in reality, there is a big archaeological site in Cyrene, with a temple of Apollo and many more. The same statue of the one in the British Museum, which is actually a Roman copy, was found there in pieces, and I don't know much about it because it's only slightly mentioned on the plague which is in the museum like next to the statue, and I tried to find more but it's really kind of, yeah, not, not, not anywhere. <laughs> and that's the myth, I am not gonna lie, I just really wanted to talk about Apollo and his lion wrestling wife Cyrene. <laughs> I mean, how, how cool can she be? <laughs> anyway, I'll see you next time, consider subscribing, and bye bye!